Hello, Mac Warriors. How is it going? Welcome to your daily dose of Mac Warrior Online. Today we are playing the Cicada again. I have to say because I, I grew fond of the Cicadas. I've played um, the three C lately, and today it's time for the three M. This is the one with the nice ballistic hardpoint here and the four energy weapons. And on top of it, I'm going quickly to the store. On top of it, the Cicada here has very cool quirks and i want to show you which one let me go ahead and check out the 3m now the 3m is very very unique in a way that it um it usually runs uh, one ballistic weapon and then some some laser weapons um uh, on top of it as backup weapons the complete opposite of what the 3c does which has a big um energy weapon the ppc and then some lighter machine guns but See that? Ultra AC gem chance minus 30%, ballistic cooldown minus 20%, ballistic velocity plus 20%, energy cooldown minus 15, energy range plus 10, and then some structure. That means if we put in an ultra auto cannon, that thing can fire very, very fast and it won't jam that often. Now we do the obvious thing, we take the Ultra AC5 with four medium lasers and on top of it, I, I forgot to say that, I forgot to mention it, um, we have an ECM. So we can be behind the enemy lines and harass them so, so, so much uh, without being seen and um, this is what we do today. We are um, Commando Cicada. Kind of, but not being a commando, but a cicada. You know what I mean, right? So four mediums, an ultra AC5, three tons of ammo, and a double heatsink on on top of an XL engine 265 uh, brings the mech to 115 kph after speed tweak. Uh, we stripped a bit of arm armor, and that's basically it. We have uh, invested into skills here. Uh, magazine capacity is crucial because we grind through our um, ammo so so fast and then uh, I was going for laser duration for even more cooldown and of course a bit of heat generation. I am not taking the enhanced rack and ultra AC gem duration node and I'm doing it for a reason namely we have a jam chance reduction quirk of 30%. That means the auto cannon won't jam that often. That means we don't get that overall big benefit out of these nodes here. And on top of it, we are running an ultra AC5 and uh, the, the jam time is dependent on the size of the weapon. So the smaller the weapon, the lower the jam time will be and the five is reasonable. So we can just um, reposition and in the meantime, our auto cannon will unjam again. So we don't necessarily need that because we are not a DPS build here, but a flanker and harasser. We have some additional structure, as you can see, um, just to bolster our overall HP. I'm going for maximum speed tweak because I want to be able to reposition fast and I want to be able to get in position fast. Also anchor turn here on top of uh, instead of torso, torso speed because uh, again just turning around and taking a sharp corner and going into the other direction is really good here. Uh, no operations, we don't need that. We, but what we definitely need is the enhanced ECM nodes. Otherwise, you will be targetable at medium range already, uh, even though you have your ECM. So this uh, reduces the range on which you are being targetable here. Very important. And then on top of it, because we are super sneaky, we can drop artillery on the unaware heads of our doomed enemies. And therefore, again, we, we are taking this. You will, you will see that, especially in the first game. It's glorious. And that's the build, everybody. I wish you a lot of fun in the two games that are coming. And as always, if you have that, then don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and now it's time to hit the battlefield all right first game of the day we are playing the river city we are playing domination what i want to do is i want to be here in fox 5 i want to be behind the enemies because i believe they will go to the citadel in the circle and camp there and uh, therefore you know like here like in the Gulf 6 area, just at this exact spot. And I want to cross all the way over here, be in Fox 5 and be behind them and harass them, drop artillery strikes and uh, just make them very, very uncomfortable. So let's see if I can do it. I have my ECM, so I can sneak just behind the enemy firing line and, uh, you know, try to do my shenanigans. The thing that I need to take care of is, of course, not getting caught. And uh, I hope I can pull it off. So what I want to do is uh, probably take in the high ground here. Honestly, nobody expects me being on the bridge, hopefully. Let's get an eye on the guys. Yeah, there's the pushbacker already moving forward. And I want the uh, the whole enemy team there, so it's uh, not necessary going in now, like directly, and dropping my artillery, because uh, the dynamics of the game are mostly so that, again, everybody will end up there in this uh, Gulf 6 spot in, uh, you know, better have a lot of targets to shoot my artillery on top of their heads too. Okay. Let's go. Fox 5, almost there. We have some of our mechs in the circle already. There they are. So again, not getting caught is the thing. Can I pull it off? Is this a good spot? 
I think I'm gonna wait a little bit longer. Hmm, where am I? Oh, yeah, look at this. This is perfect. This is right now the best. The best moment I can have. I can possibly have. So I dropped red smoke on their heads. I really hope that we have some really big impacts here. Come on. Oh no, I missed it. I misplaced it. Okay. I mean, they are not aware of me. I have some artillery. Oh, that would have been so cool if that hit. I tried to hit it on a mech, but the mech probably moved at that moment. And then I p placed it behind them. Yeah, I mean, this is, this is massive here. Okay, we start harassing them now. Want to make this guy uncomfortable. Or kill. We continue this. Okay. Guys, I've got them distracted. You can uh, push or whatever you want to do. Okay, they found me. This guy has seen me. But the blood ass is getting shred from, from my teammates. This is cool. It's really good. Okay. Okay, can we do it? Nope. Ah, almost, almost. Let's get a kill here. Come on, come on. Good. Two down, ten to go. Behind the enemy lines here. Destroyed uh, our only an arm, sadly. This is perfect. They are completely surrounded here. Oh, the jam, the jam, the jam. Okay, okay, okay. LRMs on the on the mat, dog. So much back damage there. Ah, damn it. I couldn't get the side, and now I'm getting... Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, they don't like me. Yep, yep, yep. They, they stick their light max at me. I need to go. I need to reposition. But we can, we can do it. We can just keep going. Come on, come on. Component destroyed. Was only an arm, though. I don't want to get any closer right now. I'm too afraid. Two and two. Hmm. I have a feeling we could have done. We could have done more, more damage, more kills here. And I'm getting shot at now. Yeah, there's somebody coming in. Okay. We're still in their flank. Man, we dealt so much damage already. Okay, it's time to regroup with the team. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Go away, please. Who's that? Who's shooting me? And why? We are actually losing this? How? Guys! We had it! Perfectly! They are so damaged, guys. We just need to get in and grab the kills. Don't be afraid, please. They are also team killing themselves. Let's go. Let's push. I really hope that helps. I really hope that does something. Oh, I'm dead. Ooh. If I get shot in the side there, I'm down. So we go for enemies that are not aware. Still afraid of the guy in the in the upper city there. There's a raven. What's the raven doing here? Uh, we've got one raven in our midst. We have a stealth raven running between us. He's not contested at all. I mean, my, my teammates are probably busy shooting the guys there. Okay. Let's get some more damage in. This is the Mad Dog from before. He should be very damaged. Ah, oh, damn it. Mad Dog is a one shot. Go for the Mad Dog. Alright. The problem is the heat right now. And they got me. Yeah, it was the guy in the opposite city. I didn't, I didn't pay attention there. Guys, come on, bring it to the end, please. We have it. You just need to get in and get the kills. They're all so damaged. I took care of it in the early game. Come on, you can do it, boys. Oh, man, so unfortunate. Like, if, if my teammates went in when I was turning their faces around, we could have easily done it. They were completely distracted. Oh, so much early damage, so much early, so many early kills for Hello. nothing. Oh, this is so, this is so frustrating, guys. I'm, I'm, I'm not salty, but it's just, oh, I could have been so good, but it wasn't. Oh, okay, okay. I mean, again, um, I, I just wanted to show you this strategy. It works perfectly. If I had dropped my first artillery strike and, and placed it well or better, then <laughs> we, we probably would have won it because I would have dealt massive more damage. But anyway, we got two killing blows, four kill most damage dealt and 902 damage with six components destroyed. I think it was good enough. Sometimes it's about personal achievements, you know. We're gonna see how the next game goes down. Alright, second game of the day. We are playing Solaris City. I think Solaris City in an ECM uh, medium or light mech is a lot of fun. But uh, we also play Conquest and I have no idea how the game dynamics in Conquest are, so 
I guess I just go to Kappa and find out, right? So maybe, maybe we get something, something nice here. A nice skirmish with enemy lights, mediums. Um, I'm okay-ish at uh, fighting light mechs, I would say. Since I have a very fast firing medium damage pinpoint weapon here. It's actually a low damage pinpoint weapon, but you know what I mean, right? So uh, our Ultra AC5 plus the medium lasers. Um, I think it's okay to challenge enemy light mechs. Um, we're gonna see about this. Let's see. Uh, we have a Raven as well here. Blast Master. <laughs> 3000. And uh, it seems that we are kind of alone here. Huh. Hmm? Nobody here? We just get that real quick. And then we do the get behind the enemy's firing line shenanigans with artillery and everything. So we are trying to capture it to full. And there we go. Alright. So we are ready. I wonder how it plays with stealth here. Imagine this. What are you shooting at? Okay. Okay, okay, now this is not the way we are going. Absolutely not. Enemies in Fox 4, a lot of them. They're closing in an Echo 4. Okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna take the long run. I'm not in a rush. Absolutely not. I'm a, a harasser and flanker and not a brawler. So taking the enemies uh, just face to face is a thing that I should avoid. I know, it's not honorable, but war is never honorable. Is it? No, I don't think so. Therefore, uh, we go... Oh yeah, this is a nice target here. The Orion with LRMs, so that guy cannot really really contest us. Or, you know, this guy is not dangerous if we are behind him. Now we need, we need to find a block where we actually can, can close in here. I think this is it. Yep, alright. There's one guy up top. How did he get up there? This is, this is interesting. Do you see the Marauder? This is... What? The sneaky, the sneaky marauder on top of the thing, shooting, shooting rocks down below. Okay, now this is scary a little bit because I think enemies are close, very close. Yep, exactly. Come on. Not enough, not enough to take it down, but we have a big guy coming in, and of course our artillery should be dropping in a second. Got the side also there, and now he's down to an Alpha 5. Okay. Nice. Now, that was that was important here. Okay. Oh, the jams. Okay, I'm not here. Mm-hmm. Okay, I need, I need to go. Let, let, let's get out of here. My team is mildly dying, and uh, what I can do is, again, do another flanking maneuver. Try to disrupt their, their positioning a little bit. Ah, damn it. I wanted to get the wolf out. Sight also is crit. What's this guy? It's dead. Okay. Where's the bull found? Okay, I don't, I don't see the bull found anymore. There's a nice ferret. Artillery. No, it's not, it's not ready. Oh my god! The lasers! The lasers! Damn it! I didn't see it. Ah, oh, this is unfortunate. I was like, hey, we can, we can, we can stay here, but I, I got so much return fire for nothing. Oh, and here comes the ice ferret hunting. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my freaking god. Artillery? Okay, I got it out. Is the wolf out? Yes, sometimes it's uh, important to keep track of what's going on. Now, the question is, shall I go and cap or shall I try to destroy more max? I'm not a good, I'm not anymore in a good fighting condition. Absolutely. I want to be active though, I want to help out the team. So maybe we get something done here. I think I'm only, or mo mostly, oh? mostly shooting my auto cannon here. Get wrecked. The gems. Oh, oh. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, oh, oh. I was, I was banking on my auto cannon to be ready there. Come on. Oh, he's twisting in. My team should be able to, to get the kill though. He's super cherry red in the back. The Blood Asp is one shot in the back. Um, yeah, good job, guys. Power is just coming into the rescue all the time here. I like this. And this is probably the Marauder. This is the Marauder with the rocks up top there. Okay. What is he doing up there? Is he, is he gonna kill me? That's the question here. Am I gonna kill him? Uh, he might be killing me. Oh, and he's a stick now. <laughs> All right. What we need is Stata. Oh, what a game. 
decap one. Mm. Yeah, I believe so. It might be. It might be okay if you just get theta. Yeah, maybe if we cap it, but if not, as soon as I yeah. No, no. Yeah, it is. Cool. All right, that was a, that was a great round. It was so cool running right. around here in the city, just getting into the flanks of our underwear enemies with a medium I mean, fast mag like and ECM, <laughs> and of course some some nice Daka on top of it. Cool game. That was fun, absolutely. Now we have three killing blows, six assists, one kill, most damage dealt, 576 damage done with seven components. Again, uh, I think Power was the MVP here. Um, at, at least it felt like it. He was coming in and, and just securing the kills with the Kuga and uh, preventing me from getting killed a bunch of times. So you're my lifesaver, Power. Anyway, that is your daily dose, guys. And if you enjoyed it, then don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you want to support me, go down below to the description. There's the link to my Patreon page. And I hope to see you on the battlefield. Goodbye.